Hey there everyone, this is Danielle, checking out another viewer level in Super Mario Maker 2. Uh, this one is called Desert Bus, and it's based on Desert Bus, the video game. Apparently it doesn't take 8 hours, so that's good. Uh, the course code is 34D44RDRG, and it's made by Lyra, who is a cutie. So let's check it out. Uh, I've entered the code into the game. As you can see, uh... There we go, um, and let's, let's give it a look. It's interesting that it doesn't download the course when you get to that screen, so that it doesn't have to, oh, hang on, I can't jump. Uh... Um, oh, I see, I see, okay, so we've got wind, and a conveyor belt, and we're not allowed to jump, so when the wind comes up, the conveyor belt stop us from moving at all. Oh, that's really clever, oh wow. So yeah, I'm running forward at full speed, because I can't jump off the conveyor belt, this is the best I can do. Um... And I'm making slow progress through this desert here. So it's, it's a 500 second level. I don't know if I'll need all of that time. We'll see how we go. Um, but yeah, that's one of the things you can do in Mario Maker 2. You can make a level where you're not allowed to jump or you're not allowed to do various other things. There's a couple of different course restrictions that you can pick from. It's pretty cool. So you can do like Captain Toad style levels, which is neat. Although, it, the way it works is you can't touch the ground after leaving it, so it doesn't quite work for Captain Toad, because in that game, you just can't jump, but you are allowed to leave the ground. So, you know, it's, it's a bit different. Run, 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 run. Okay, so yeah, this is, this is a pretty accurate simulation of Desert Bus, honestly. Um, you gotta just keep running and go into the pipe, there we go. Oh no, there's more. Should there be music playing? I don't know if maybe the wind effect cancels out the music or something. It's really quiet. I think the real Desert Boss doesn't have music either, so it fits. I, I haven't actually, you know, played it or anything, so I'm not really sure. Um, that little, like, speech bubble with the little Toadette flag, that's indicating that I haven't violated the clear condition, like I haven't jumped yet. Uh, that'll disappear if I jump, so I'm not gonna jump. Um, I mean, this isn't quite an accurate desert bus simulation, because I could just, like, put something on these two buttons I'm holding, the right button and the, the Y button, instead of actually, um... You know, constantly playing. In the real desert bus, you actually have to steer because the bus veers off to the side. Um, but here, you can just hold the right arrow, and it seems to work pretty well, unless I'm misunderstanding how this works. But yeah, I think this is an accurate simulation of desert bus, uh, apart from that limitation. Um, it's impossible to make it take eight hours. The best you can do is 500 Mario seconds. And I think that's a bit faster than 500 real seconds. So, yeah. So, yeah, this is, um... Desert Bus for Hope, but it's, it's, it's... It's a, it's a... Mario Maker level, and it's not nearly long enough to be a good fundraiser, because it's finishable in probably just a few minutes. Well. Oh cool, I got the world record! <laughs> okay, that is really cool. I'm gonna like that. I like how someone said plain boring reason why people consider video games a waste of time because 
yeah, it's 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 desert bus. It's a, it's a desert bus level. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, well that's the desert bus level. There's not much to look at beyond that. That's the level. Um, I hope you enjoyed me playing it and occasionally thinking of something to say. And thanks.